I love the camera flying around during, during my comedy. There's just a camera just zipping around the room. It's so crazy because they said, do you want a jib for your show? And I was like, what do we need a jib for? Look at what it's doing right now. <laughs> like, does that make what's happening funnier? Like, does, are my jokes funnier if a camera's like flying through the air? Like, wow, look at this guy. <laughs> Jesus, just won't stop. <laughs> oh, I mean, I would hate it. I would feel bad if you got hit in the head, you guys. But from my perspective, I can't think of anything funnier right now. <laughs> than to see somebody get clocked in the head by this crazy jib arm. Okay, start your way up there. Oh, I love this power. <laughs> I feel like I'm that kid with the Iron Giant. Okay, jib arm, I need you to kill this guy right here. <laughs> Say, jib arm, I was kidding. No jib arm. Don't do it, jib arm. All right, get back up there, jib arm. This is as close as I'll get to being in How to Train Your Dragon. <laughs> toothless, toothless. All right. <laughs> Stop moving, what are you doing? Why are you doing this to me? All right, let me do a joke where get, get the jib back over there and just do like a crazy flying uh, jib shot of me telling the next joke and we'll see if everyone thinks that that makes this joke funnier. All right, here we go. Just go sweeping across as I tell this joke. You know, it's a good thing emotional scars are invisible because if emotional scars were visible, porn would be disgusting. I think I figured it out. I think I'm just like too high to have a thing flying around the room <laughs> while I'm telling jokes. I'm like just too conscious of it. And I knew I would be, so I was like, don't bring that goddamn jib in here. <laughs> and they're like, oh, we're bringing it in and it's gonna fly around like crazy. <laughs> your your stand-up's gonna look like it was directed by Brian De Palma. 